Hey, what's up? I'm back again with a new update on the permanent magnet motor, my new invention. I'm Magic. Welcome to Energy Graphy. This is a new part for a new rotational magnet. If you want to see how to make all the parts, you can see the previous video, which I will put a link at the end of this video. So, I added a glass flywheel that has both a good weight and no effect and the motion of the magnet. The engine is completely assembled and ready to test. We have a negative pole and a positive pole, one of which pushes the piston and the other absorbs it. By repelling the magnet, the crankshaft performs a complete half rotation, but it does not produce significant energy when absorbed. Of course, more than half a spin is done accurately, and this is a good strength, it's a success. In this system, we need half a turn for each piston which means that the probability of working with this system is really high. What do you think? In the next video, should I make a prototype of this engine or a linear motion of the several cylinder? Be sure to write in the comments. Well, here is this part. We will add a magnet to see what the result is better or worse. Now, in this case, the magnet is locked and we see that in the previous case the engine works better. 
For the last test, we change the timing of the belt. Oh my gosh, this is very really good. The result was great. And the crankshaft rotated more than 300 degrees. Very close to 360 degrees. This is wonderful. And now we test with four magnets. Two positive and two negative. This is good, but the best case is with two positive magnets and one negative magnet. And add another flywheel to the engine and see the result. Not with two flywheel is too heavy and has a negative effect. And in the videos, I made with an animation and show it to you. And I honestly said that it might not work for these reasons, for many reasons. But I'm trying to find a new solution to these problems. And for these reasons, I will design the next version by finding the problem of the previous example and show them to you. No, I'm practically started from the first version. And so far, the project is going better than I imagined it in the animations. And I see that in the first idea, we are very, very close, very close to the real example that work. And what is your suggestion for building the next prototype? Please write to me in the comments. And finally, jump into the comment. Let me know if you like this video. Be sure to check out one of the ones. I will link it right here. And be sure to subscribe and hit that notification. As always, I'd like to thank all of you for watching. I will see you in the next one.